the one thing that doesn't work is stuffing our grief because grief will be expressed one way or another. And if we don't express it, then it will leak. And leaks are usually trouble and uh, or we end up regretting things. And you know what? We have enough regrets already. So finding ways to express our grief is really, really, really important. And one of the ways that you talked about doing that at the holidays, I thought was really uh, both enlightening and um, and seems boundlessly helpful. This idea of, um, I think you called it having some memory sharing uh, among your loved ones. If If you're facing this holiday for the first time without someone who's been there the whole time, have a memory sharing party um, where people talk about their favorite memories about the person who's no longer with us. Why is that so helpful? That, that thing. It's, it's huge because one of the things I hear from a lot of grieving people and I've experienced it myself too, is that nobody brings up my loved one. I want to talk about them. Um, right. or if I do bring up my loved one, everybody gets uncomfortable and goes silent and walks away or changes the subject or, um, all of those things, you know, that, that hurts. And so when we can gather people or when people can come together and it doesn't need to be a lot of people either. And the understanding is, uh, let's say we lost Steve this year. We're going to share memories about Steve. Um, we're just going to talk about Steve and, and see where it goes. And yeah, we, we know we're going to cry. Yeah, parts of it are going to be painful and difficult. But what I hear from people that do memory sharing, and when I've been involved in memory sharing, um, it's kind of scary going in because you don't know what it's going to be like. Uh, everybody's concerned about expressing too much emotion. But what happens is, as people begin to talk, the grief begins to come out in healthy and natural ways. And it is emotional. Part of it is painful. But what everyone says and what I would say is, oh, but that was so good. I'm mm. so glad we did that. 